Hi, I'm Mike and welcome to my flat. And this is what he's really into. We are Barry, Ben, Jamie and Mike, the guys from Sorted Food. When it comes to cooking, everyone likes different things. So today, join us in one of our homes to see what we love to eat and why. Get ready, because we're making it personal. It's too easy to forget to have breakfast every morning, especially when you need a decent amount of protein if you're at the gym or you're on a specific diet. So, Ben and I have come up with this brilliant recipe that fills you up, is fruity, is healthy, and it also can be substituted as a dessert. You've said it all, and it's so simple to do. It's high protein fruit and that yogurt, and it begins with oats. Slow release of carbs. Excellent. Okay, slow release of energy. Sort you out for the day. Not a lot to them. Yeah. So we're going to toast them. Just add them into a pan, and like you would nuts, just keep moving it in a hot, dry pan, and the toasted oats just taste so much better. Now, we've got three different types of nuts in here. Pistachios. I like them. Uh, almonds. And Brazil nuts. Gold star. Now, actually, all of these nuts have sort of different levels of uh, minerals and vitamins and, and good fats. But I didn't realise until recently, Brazil nuts, you're not supposed to have too many of them. Yeah, poisonous, aren't they? Like they say, literally three or four a day is as many as you should have because beyond that, the toxins aren't brilliant for you. And you just kind of roughly chop, chop them up, those two there. And as they warm up, they release all their natural oils and that kind of helps them to toast. And it's worth pointing out, we're just doing a handful here, but you could just as easily do loads of this at the start of the week, yeah. have it pre-toasted in the cupboard, ready to go, and then just use it as and when, breakfast or dessert. That's the key, that when you're trying to eat healthily or you're eating for a goal, Make it as easy as possible because you'll use any excuse to bottle it and to leave it. But also make sure it tastes good. Like if, yeah. if you're eating it just for function, you're never going to be able to stick to it. So make sure it tastes good. Choose nuts that you like and make it personal. Cool. And then we're going to put that over the top of yogurt. Okay, so to start off with very simple natural yogurt, if you put that into there. And two things to naturally sweeten and flavour, and I think these are two amazing ingredients. One of them, almond butter. Yes. Now I know you love peanut butter, but it's so good. It's enough of a variation, enough difference. Um, to keep you interested. And another very natural ingredient, we've got Manuka honey. Which tastes amazing, but it is very expensive, so you can use normal honey as well. Yes. A little bit goes an awful long way, and then you can whisk all of that up. And obviously at this point, lots of flavour in there, but now we're going to add in the protein bit. There is protein in the almond butter. But there isn't yes. enough, Ben. <laughs> Not enough as far as you're concerned. So here we've got our whey protein. Completely unflavoured stuff. It just sort of thickens it up a little bit, but it makes it super rich in protein. And now, can you smell these? Oh, yeah, they smell great. Take it off the heat now, just to begin to cool down, and we can prep some fruit. None of these things are integral to the recipe. They are interchangeable to keep it interesting, to keep you on your targets and your goals. But we've gone for a red apple, just because the colour looks great, and it's good flavour, the sweetness. Remember, one of your five a day. Grab ourselves a bowl. I think that's another key as well, that when you're eating this type of food, freshness, you crave sometimes that fresh fruit or that fresh salad or something like that, if you're eating meat and just stuff. Plenty of apple, blueberries, you've got antioxidants in there. A couple of blackberries, use whatever fruit you want. Whatever the fruit you want. <laughs> and plenty of that crunch on top. Finish it with the optional extra drizzle of honey. You can choose if you want. How quick was that? Super quick. I mean, it takes a little bit of time to get the pieces ready at the start of the week, but then seconds to throw together. It's our high protein fruit and nut yogurt sorted. Right, I'm sure Mike has painted this perfect picture of his perfect life. Supposedly, he's a very active man. Very active. Very active. Which is why his bike, which is just here, uh, we bought this about a month and a half, two months ago for his birthday. Yeah, no, it was a nice um, predictor. We know how active he likes to be. Yeah, still wrapped up. Thanks, Mike. Well done. Now, a man's life can be told by his DVD collection. No? So let's have a look at Mike's DVD collection, yeah, shall we? Yeah, yeah. Snatch, thing. Fight Club. Bad Boys, one and two. Perfect. Love Actually. <laughs> Get emotional there. Love Actually. It is an emotional film. It is. I'm also guessing that Mike's bigged up the fact that he plays football a lot and that he's in a band and he's he does so all this busy. really good stuff. So busy. He's lying because all he's actually doing is watching The O.C. And it's not The O.C., it's Disney films. Mm. Um, and most of these he watches on his own with his favourite drink in the world. These are just a few of Mike's grooming products. You couldn't hold any more. He, um, he couldn't go anywhere without his trusty hair dryer, mm. as any man would. And then, hairspray. Mm -hmm. I mean, you've got hairspray, have you? Yeah, yeah. yeah we all, we've all got hairspray. Yeah, it's fine. Moisturiser. I don't have that. Not just one moisturiser. No? 
too moisturised one. I think this is a tinted moisturiser because you never know. <laughs> it has to match that beautiful smile of his. Yeah, it does, yeah. Ding! Top of the list, um, we've got Katy Perry Raw. Yep. 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 Uh, we've then got the entire One Direction album. All of it. Um, Even track 12. Track, track 12, yeah, 13, Crazy. 14, 15. He's got a playlist called Strip Club Music, which is good to know. Britney Spears, Christine Aguilera. Wow. Um, he is R. Kelly as well. No, I mean, what can we say? I think that gives probably a much more accurate example of what Mike's life is really like. Let's eat it, and then we'll tell you how good it tastes. <laughs> Amazing. That's good. I'm so happy with this, mate. So good. Good. Well, it was made for you. It was personal for you. I know. What we want to know, though, is what is personal for you. How do you get over your breakfast dilemma? 